Hey, how's it going today? This is Rich. Just want to show you a site I built with Weebly. I know that uh, King Human has been recommending uh, Wix a lot. He shows a lot about Wix. I'll tell you, I've been using Weebly for a while, and this is really cool. It's a website I set up called uh, get20picks.com. I got from Namecheap. But you can go into Weebly, and you can either use a, uh, a domain name that you bought like that, or you, know, you can uh, just use a... Uh, free web domain that they provide with but it's got weebly.com on the end and also the weebly sites have that footer that's kind of not very attractive and so I'm going to show you how to get rid of that footer and do a little editing using weebly now, a lot of different themes and things that you can use weebly you can set up these different pages and you can go in and edit a page at a time and here's a page that goes to this uh, 20 ways to learn income. I meet a lot of people locally and from out of town, and I've just been giving out this website for folks to go check out. Also got uh, 20 things to do in this uh, in my town, St. Louis. Uh, a lot of cool stuff here. I still have. I am adding things to this. I was just going to show you how. Easy, there's another link to that uh, work from home. Um, just going to show you how to get rid of that footer on the uh, home page there homepage that takes them to the three different things. Um, there's like this net spend deal, there's uh, 20 things to do in St. Louis, and then there's 20 ways to make money online. So anyway, here are some of the things you can uh, uh, drag and drop over to Weebly. Another cool thing about Weebly is very SEO friendly, but if you notice here on the bottom of this page that where you can edit when you're in edit mode, you won't see that on the uh, normal website. That stuff will just be a big white area. When I scroll down here, you'll see that. <clears throat> so that's what you will actually uh, see once it's published. Uh, nothing, you know. But you can always go back into the editor and fill in those, um, like those text blocks or whatever, to uh, put stuff in there. So I'm going to add an image here. And I looked up on Google for uh, King Human, and actually the first thing that came up, one of the first images was. Dave Goodman, and it's actually, you know, King Ralph, the old movie, and uh, I'm going to go find that here in my uh, downloads, and uh, it's pretty, it's a pretty good fit for this site, actually, because uh, uh, John Goodman from the Blues Brothers, from the King Ralph movie, you know, he's been at the Roseanne show, he's actually from St. Louis, so that's pretty cool. So if I, I'm going to add that image to this website, <clears throat> and then you got to click Publish, and also, before I do that, publish, I'm going to go ahead and put in the code that you got to put in to get rid of that footer. So I'm going to hit settings, I'm going to go over to the SEO tab thing, and then in the footer section, I'm going to put this code in. Now, if you don't you have a hard time seeing this or whatever, go ahead and send me a, a PM, and I can send you this code so that you can get rid of that footer on the bottom of Weebly. It works really great, so then it just looks like a normal site. Now, Weebly, this is an old website that I set up, and I got this free Weebly domain, but then I got the domain name um, the I bought from uh, Namecheap, uh, get20picks.com, get20picks.com. Then I just forwarded that to that, that last domain that you saw, and then I think... I didn't even mask it, so you can, once you arrive on that page, you can still see the, uh, uh, whatever that long Weebly address was. Well, anyway, uh, after I publish it, uh, there's no more Weebly footer, and you can see that I just added that image down there of uh, John Goodman. So anyway, uh, that's just a little tutorial, and like I said, uh, you know, if you uh, need any help with that code, uh, Weebly's, I've been using it for a number of years, and it's just... Uh, been really uh, a good platform to use, very SEO friendly, and uh, it's like a Web 2.0 uh, site, so it really helps. Uh, anyway, hope that helps you out, and like I said, give me a PM if you need help with that code.